What up, YouTube? I just come to address these shit-talking-ass Georgia Bulldog fans about the mediocre-ass win that they got on uh, Saturday night. And uh, I'll get to that right after this. Do you know what the most frightening thing in the world is? What's up, YouTube? I want to put out an all points, points bulletin to the daggone Georgia Bulldog fans, okay? Y'all overreacting. You count your eggs for the damn hatch. Shit, I got friends as Georgia Bulldog fans, okay? They daggone all on my Facebook page, on my Instagram. They calling me. They texting me. How about them dogs? Jump your dogs. Go dog. Man, fuck them dogs. Y'all ain't did a damn thing. Y'all out here celebrating like y'all won a national championship, okay? You celebrate the fact that your offense scored a measly three daggone points, okay? How you go through four quarters and don't score but three points and think you done did some shit? I give it to you. Your daggone defense, they did all right. That's what won the game for you, okay? Your defense did all right, but shit. Just like y'all had some daggone offensive starters out, shit, Clemson did too, okay, on the, on the offensive line. So, hey, y'all ain't, ain't did nothing special, but you act like you have, okay? You ain't Bama, okay? Just so you know. You ain't a leak, Kirby Smart on goddamn TV after the, after the daggone game talking about that's what they've been preaching all spring, being a leak, being a leak, where well, you ain't a leak. You want to be. Ain't nothing elite about college football but Alabama. That that's that's it, okay? So y'all can shut up with all that bullshit. Okay, you won one game. Big deal. Okay, hell. I, I, I try to be nice, you know what I'm saying? I daggone predicted y'all to go un, undefeated, but shit. But the way your offense look, you probably won't even do that. Hell. All this daggone bragging and shit like you done did some shit. Then I see a daggone article on the internet talking about the damn three reasons why Georgia Bulldogs can, can uh, stop Alabama's dominance, which we all know that ain't going to happen. And the, and the three reasons was they're going to get their starters back on, on the offensive line. I don't give a damn who you get back. You won't fuck with Alabama, okay? Then they, they say uh, your defense can give any offense problems. Now you might give them a problems for a half, but you damn sure won't give Alabama problems the whole game. You ain't got enough, okay? All right. Uh, what, what, what the third reason? Oh, your running back core. Your running back core is enough to give any defense problems. Bullshit. Y'all ain't showed me nothing. You, you, you need to work on your damn quarterback because J.T. Daniels ain't it. He, he trash, and he proved that Saturday night. Straight fucking garbage. Okay, we got, our, we got daggone Bryce Young, his first damn game start. Oh, he, he out there setting records, okay? Yeah, y'all might say, well, y'all didn't play Clemson. Oh, who gives a damn? Clemson in the same daggone conference as Miami, okay? So, don't come with that excuse. Matter of fact, he might do the same thing as to, to dag on Georgia because I'm quite sure that Georgia will be, will, well, I ain't, I ain't so sure, but y'all might make it to the SEC championship. But one thing I am sure, Alabama going to be there. If, if you be there, we going to be there. If you ain't, we going to be there. It's going to be either Georgia or Florida. Hell, Georgia, you might not beat Florida. Shit, Florida didn't look too good, but hell, y'all didn't either. Oh, look at our defense. Look at our defense. Okay, it's the first game. All right, can you, can you sustain that level of play through the whole season? 
you know, we know Alabama can. It has been proven time and time again. So y'all keep on talking. Keep your faith, okay? I hope y'all make it to the SEC championship because you know why? And I hope y'all be undefeated when you get there because we will, okay? But I tell you what, you see us in the SEC championship, we're going to whoop your ass, Georgia Bulldogs. And hopefully with that one loss, y'all will still go to the playoffs and hope we meet again so we can beat your ass again. And you can believe that. Y'all talking all this goddamn bullshit. You know, all my videos, I try to be nice and say nice things about, you know, all these teams. Maybe with the exception of LSU, and I went too hard on them. But hell, LSU, like I told y'all, y'all trash. And I told you you was going to lose against UCLA. Garbage asses. So, hey, LSU fan, don't come at with me, me, with, me with no bullshit. When y'all finally do get a win, okay? Fucking Florida. Y'all look like garbage too. Y'all playing all these small schools and daggone struggling and shit. But uh, I didn't want to get that off, get off my chest, man, because Georgia, y'all getting on my damn nerves. Shit, y'all fans worse than LSU fans, and y'all say Alabama fans arrogant. Shit. Sorry, Georgia Bulldogs, but y'all ain't it. Y'all ain't it. So, Georgia, Bulldog fans, y'all ought to get tired of this shit year after year after year. Y'all y'all let them Bulldogs get y'all hopes up and shit, and you get disappointed every time, year after year. And you continue to watch us win national championship year after year, SEC championship year after year after year. We know you want to be like us, but you ain't us. Y'all got a long way to go. So, sorry to bust your bubble, but that's just the way it is. Hell, you might want to, we got enough room on, on, on the tide bandwagon, you might want to jump on and ride with us. Shit. Because that's the only way you, you'll make it to a national championship is to jump on the tide bandwagon. And it's sad that we have to come to daggone Atlanta, Georgia, and beat y'all basically in your own front yard not your back yard your front yard so hey we did it in the national championship <laughs> I'm, I'm quite sure you remember that and we'll do it again so Kirby Smart JT Daines and whoever else think that they can hang with us y'all just keep thinking it y'all keep talking and around what is it November, December time frame, we'll see. We already know the outcome, whether it's you, Georgia, or you, Florida, because y'all are only teams in the West, really, because ain't shit over there. Even though y'all over there still ain't shit over there. So y'all keep it up. Keep it up. And uh, you're going to get what you're asking for. Trust me. Trust me. You're going to get what you're asking for, Georgia Bulldog. And like I said, I got y'all going undefeated, but we all know y'all subject to do some dumb shit and lose a game that you shouldn't lose, okay? You, you better get your offense straight. That's what you better do. Shit. Matter of fact, you better work on your defense some more if you think you're going to beat them. Shit. You got the shit. Matter of fact, just cancel the whole goddamn season and work on your goddamn football team and then just show up at the SEC Championship and we'll whoop your ass. We just going to continue to play our season not until that time. Better save all your players. Hey, matter of fact, I think we can beat y'all with our second string, so it's all good. You, you ain't got Nick Saban, buddy. You ain't got Bryce Young. You ain't got Brian Robinson. You ain't got that. And your defense, even though they played a good game Saturday night, your defense ain't defense ain't better than my defense. So don't even put that in your daggone head. So to all you Bulldog fans, calm the fuck down. You overreacting. Okay? You overreacting. So that's all I want to say. And uh, roll tide.